everyone i'm delighted to have you back on my channel in today's tutorial i'm going to show you how to use n and all logical functions in excel it's very much important to know how to use this function because it's going to save you a lot of time consider subscribing if you're new to this channel and if you're old also welcome back to my channel so i'm going to show you how to use this two logical functions to achieve optimal results so we're going to start with the the n function so we want to get a result using the n logical statement and we also try for the all logical statement so basically what is going to happen is that if we want to go with the n then our conditions both conditions need to be true so in this case we have the names of let's say our students and then their numbers and we have three subjects so let's say we want a qualification in order to go for further studies and we want to make sure that the person meet the minimal requirements for both sub that's the three subjects in order to proceed to the next to further studies then in that case we have to go with the logical functions okay logical functions may will make sure that every statement is true so that means the three subjects so we are going to demonstrate this and see how this is going to work so let's say we want to make sure that the person scores 70 percent and above in order to proceed to a further studies then the three subjects need to be 70 percent and above then we can go with the end function so let's see how we can do this so we're going to say equal to end so we're going to use this statement so we're going to say the first subject that is mass so we're going to say the first subject which is mass we're going to say greater or equal to so when we say greater or equal to means that the 70 percent we are typing is inclusive so when the person gets 70 and above then the person can proceed for further studies and this is going to be true or false statement so when this statement is true then we're going to get a true statement otherwise it's going to be false so that's the that's for math then we do for science as well so science must also be what greater or equal to what 70 and then lastly we'll go for social studies so in this case we want the student to score 17 and above and all these three subjects in order to proceed so when we get the true statement that means the person score 70 percent and above so in this case when we hit the end i can see we are getting the true statement meaning this particular student emmanuel qualified to go for further study meaning he scored 70 percent and above in every subject remember to subscribe and don't forget to turn on the notification bell so to get the result for the rest of our student we just have to click and then drag this square box down here and then we can see what is going to happen so you can see from the list serum also scores 70 percent above for the three subjects. that means it's true you can go for further studies what about john john had force that means he might have filled in two or one or two subjects meaning he's getting forced and he can go for further studies when we come for prince the same prince is also for force that means he had some score less than what 70 percent clearly you can see from here prince score 67 which is basically which is basically less than 70 percent 56 is also less than that kali also scores 70 and above for all the three service so that is true evans scores 70 percent for all and kofi scored even though he had 19 social studies 67 and he had 19 in science 67 in social studies and 55 mass is less than 70 so he can go for further studies so with logical statement we are using the and that's the ants logic statement every condition needs to be true but let's use the same results and then try for the all and see for the all statement we just need one to be true in order for us to get a true statement and the rest will be what false so we're going to try this and say equal to then we say all and then the same process so that is the first result. that's mass greater or equal to 70 then social studies as well greater or equal to 70 and then lastly we come to social studies greater or equal to 70. so this same thing let's see the result we are going to get when you hit enter we can see we are getting true for this as well this is because everyone here is get is over 70 even one person is getting less than 70 it's still going to be true so in this we just need one condition to be true in order to get a true statement that is for the all logical statement let's drag this down and see what is going to happen you can see every student is getting a true because in one way or the other every student score at least 70 in 
any of the three subjects. So we're going to get a true statement for this. So that's the difference between the logical or and then the logical end statement. I'm going to have more tricks on this channel. In order not to miss any of this, you need to subscribe to this channel. And also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorial. More things coming up and you don't need to miss that. So remember to like share this video with friends. Like come away again. Bye bye.